All right, folks, time for the Mentor Mitsubishi Golf Tip of the Week. Special treat for you this week. You don't get the golf tip from me. You're going to get it from the head golf professional here at Congress Lake, Tom Atchison. Tom, fabulous Great. practice facility, huh? Facility. I mean, one awesome. of the, one of one the most beautiful practice facilities I've ever seen. We drove up here. I mean, you're looking at horses as you're coming up, and I mean, great short game area. I mean, just awesome, man. Really great good. place. So, and the other thing you're not going to believe is this guy right here. Last year was the senior player of the year in the Northern Ohio PGA. The guy looks like he's 37 years old. I mean, that's a pretty good start right there. Uh, you know, Tom's a great player. He's actually played in the senior PGA championship last year at Valhalla. He's headed to Michigan again in May, May 24th through the 27th, right yep. around in there. Yeah. He's headed to Michigan, gonna play in the senior PGA championship again, two years in a row. And, uh, you know, very accomplished player in our section here, and, and we're glad to have you on the show. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, Jimmy. Thanks. And, and you know what, Tom? I think the key, what I'd like you to tell, tell myself and all the fans here is that, you know, these are huge tournaments that you're playing. Yeah. And you've played yeah. tournament golf your whole life. You know, what do you do? What would you tell the fans out there, you know, if, you're, if they're going to play in, the, uh, in a tournament where they're nervous, you know, where they got to prepare club themselves? Yeah, club championship. Yeah, club championship. Exactly right. Member guests, all that stuff. You know, what do you do to calm those nerves and make sure you, you know you just hit consistent golf shots? I think the biggest thing is you've got to really try to focus everything out and yeah. think about your shot. Okay. Which actually brings in your pre-shot routine. Okay. Show me a little bit of what Which I don't think do. hardly anybody ever does that. They just yeah. step up and swing See, at it. You didn't hit it, right? You got to be thinking about the shot you're trying to hit. Okay. Show me you your pre-shot routine. Show me. What I mean, you I actually get, you know, behind the ball, and the big thing is I try to visualize the shot I'm trying to hit. I'm not gonna. Visualize the out of bounds is to the left, right. the water's to the right, and you gotta put that out and focus on your shot. Go for through sure. your routine for me. Show me yeah, what you do. Yeah, I just get back here. I visualize my shot. The biggest, my biggest swing key, which I think for every average player would be a huge help, is the tempo and finishing their swing. Okay. So many times we see people falling off bounds, swinging hard from the top. Right. All I think about is timing and tempo and holding my swing. And all I'm thinking about right now is a shot that I'm trying to see. This I just do to get my timing. And you know what, Tom? When you do that, and you talked about it, and see how Tom holds his balance there. He holds it because he wants to make sure that he stays on balance for yeah. the shot, right? Yep. I mean, exactly. that's so important. You, how many players do we see out there every day on They're, the range and on a tee? I mean, it, it's, you know, it's, it's falling backwards, so yeah, and, back. and it's there's no balance to it. Yep. But another key that you just saw Tom do, and I think is tremendous, and I think it's probably one of the reasons he's a great tournament player is, you know, that little take back thing that you do just to do, that's just a trigger for you, isn't it? A trigger, and it is actually part of my swing. Okay. I mean, it's a t timing thing. I mean, I do it same way, same pace, same everything every time. So that is actually the start of my swing, even Show though it, it looks like a pre-shot. Pre yeah, yeah. So you actually feel like this, this little pre-shot thing swing. is part of your golf swing. And it swing. gets me just going. It, okay. pulls, it pulls my tr trigger. And, that, and you know, and that's, again, that little move that Tom did, that doesn't have to be your move. It doesn't have no. to be that, right? It just look needs at, to be a trigger, you know, Look right? at, uh, you know, Jason uh, the winner last week. Yeah, Jason Duffner, yep. Yep. Whatever it is that gets you relaxed and gets you going into your swing so, and gets you thinking of a tempo. you got to have tempo. And, and so what Tom's telling you is the key is your golf swing doesn't start when you're standing over the goal, right? And your golf up. swing starts, you know, in your routine. That's when your golf swing starts. Yep. And then you go through, finish into a balanced position, huh? Yep, exactly. Good luck in, Jimmy, in thank Michigan, you. man. We hope, thank we, you. hope you go, try. go up and make us a little money in Ohio, bring it back to Ohio. We like that Michigan money coming back Absolutely. to Ohio. Absolutely, <laughs> no doubt. What a great guy to have for the tip. That is your mentor. Mitsubishi Golf Tip of the Week.